every term we face political game playing trying to tie the hands of the government. A hard Brexit option. I think a lot of people are very disconcerted by that. We're going to campaign and we're going to win the seats that we need to form a Labour government. Simple as that. Good morning, Britain. That's the news you're waking up to this morning. The first test for Theresa's snap election as Westminster prepares to vote on the Prime Minister's plan today. We'll ask Anne Widdicombe why she thinks Mrs May has moved too early. A promise for richer lives for everyone. Jeremy Corbyn unveils his so-called real alternative. But what are his chances of implementing it? 20 years on and still struggling to get over his mother's death. Prince William opens up. People go, I can't last that long, but it does. You never get over it. It's such an unbelievably big moment in your life um, that it, it never leaves you. And from Coronation Street to the Crucible, actor Charlie Condu reveals why his new show aims to combat fake news. Wednesday, 19th of April, 2017. Live from ITV Studios in London, this is Good Morning Britain with Piers Morgan and Susanna Reid. Our main news adds 8 o'clock this morning. MPs today expected to vote for the snap election to happen on the 8th of June. Theresa May says she wants to secure the backing of the British people for the Brexit negotiations. The Prime Minister said that Britain needs certainty, stability and strong leadership following the EU referendum. Our political editor Ranveer Singh is in Westminster. Here we go again, Ranveer. <laughs> Absolutely. It feels a bit like Groundhog Day. And if you've seen um, Brenda from Bristol 